guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm bringing you another Poundland haul. I am so excited for this month's Poundland haul, as you can tell. I absolutely love doing the Poundland hauls. I hope you guys enjoy watching me make them. I just love getting into Poundland and finding a good bargain. I mean, who doesn't? But I mean, I absolutely love it. The lighting is changing, so I do apologise, it'll fix itself, it's just the sun that never ever appears and then all of a sudden Charmin's filming and it's like, ah! But, what can I do? I can't do that much about that. We just need to keep on rolling and hopefully the sun will calm itself down. As you guys might have already noticed, I actually did get my hair done. Let me know what you think about it. I actually got it done professionally and I got it a wee bit shorter than what I normally would. Let me know if you like it. I really like it. I think it's really nice and... A lot more healthier than what it was before to say the least but I am super duper excited to show you what I got so let's just get into the video. Now on the train of getting a hair fix, getting it done, everything like that, I actually picked up this really cool product from Poundland which is a Lee Stafford The Big Shower Comb. It's the perfect hair hookup to comb through your favourite treatment or conditioner. I actually thought it was amazing that you could get something like that in the pound shop. This of course was only a pound which makes it even better. It's a big massive comb and it has the wee hook there if you are wanting to buy, if you're wanting to hang it to your shower. Um, in the back it kind of gives you a wee bit more information but again like I said usually the Lee Stafford stuff you always get it in boots and stuff like that and normally it's around about £10 ish if not more. But it's great that you can actually get something like this in the Poundland and I think it's a really good bargain. I'm looking forward to trying it out because I'm going to try and keep my hair in really good condition and hopefully this might be helpful to save me from like tugging at my hair um, when I come out the shower. It might be useful to kind of comb it through beforehand. But let me know if you guys have tried this before because I'm quite interested to see if it actually works that well. And yeah, I mean, I'm looking forward to trying it. Now, I don't know if you guys have checked out the new Toy Story 4 movie. I actually really did like it. However, I feel like they should have left it in the last movie. The last movie was so... It was just... It gave me all the feels. And I think it was about time that's where it ended. However, I like the fact that they brought back the characters. Because I do love Toy Story. And my, all my family love Toy Story as well. And the reason I'm kind of chiming on about Toy Story is because I picked up these nail files. And I thought they were super cute. This one says Galactic Guardian. This one has the wee like shadow thing and then the wee boot. I thought it was ooh, ooh. I thought it was super cute. Um it just says here, reach for the sky with these super awesome nail files, and in the back it just kind of is a wee bit of information. I just really liked these. I thought they were really cute. Did I need them? Probably not. Did I want them? Definitely. I thought they were really cute and totally worth a pound for me. Again, talking about keep my hair in good condition, blah blah blah. Ugh. I managed to pick up some two new hair shampoo and liquid liquiders? What? A hair shampoo and a conditioner. Um, I just got the Schwarzkopf Gliss Hair Repair and it's the liquid silk version. It's got keratin serum in it and liquid nitrous silk. Don't know what that is. But it's supposed to be good for dry or dull hair. And I got just the two of them. These were both a pound each, which is great. And I'm definitely going to get used to these. Use them with my big comb and hopefully my hair will be absolutely fabulous. But I really do like the idea of using these. I've never tried them before, so I'll let you know how I get on. Now, of course, it is getting to that time of year where the allergy season is in. Everybody's sneezing, coughing, itchy eyes, you know. Grant has really bad hay fever. We actually picked up some hay fever tablets for him. Um, they are really good. He finds them really useful. You only take one a day and they're supposed to be really good for your allergies. He gets them really bad, so he gets them really bad. He gets allergies really bad. So this will be useful for him and hopefully make him feel a wee bit better. Is this really a Poundland haul if I didn't buy some sweets? I know I'm terrible. I've got that wedding dress to fit into, but I'm not doing very good to be honest with you. Um, I actually picked up some raisins because I've spoke to you before. I love raisins. I think they're really good. And I also picked up some Malams. These are the Happy Fruities ones. I just like that they're individual packets and it means that you get quite a lot in them. And me and Grant normally sit and eat these while watching Love Island, which is absolutely shocking because we shouldn't be eating them. We should be eating carrot sticks or something. But I mean, I like streets. So it's guys. The next item that I picked up was super cute. I love these Huggies. Um, wipes. I just like them because they have Mickey Mouse on them. That's the main reason I got them. These are the 90 years um, of Mickey, the originals. Um, these are just all over clean, safe for faces and everything else that you need to wipe. These are normally for babies but I picked them up because 
I'm just kind of finding that my baby wipes are not doing the job for me. And these are normally really good because you get quite a lot in them. You get 56 in a pack. I thought I would give them a go because I thought they might have a lot more kind of liquid in them. Um, and they might clean faster and might get a bit bigger as well, which is great. And of course, like I said, they've got Mickey Mouse in them. So I just had to have them. Again, I know you guys will probably think I'm pure harping on about my hair. But I actually picked up one of these brushes because it was only a pound. But I actually seen the hairdresser use it when she was drying my hair. Like she used that to kind of like give it a wee bit more volume and stuff like that. And actually help to dry it quicker. And this is a blow hot and cold dry brush. Um, this is just a brush pretty much with the like kind of bristly stuff on it. This was only a pound which is an absolute bargain. I know it probably isn't as good as the one that she used but I was just going to buy this see how we got on and then maybe buy a very expensive one but this might be great so hopefully it will do the same job. Um, I actually haven't done it with my hair because I only got my hair done yesterday so it's sitting pretty well but when I wash my hair and everything like that I'll let you know how I got on with that. Me and Grant are actually currently going to Disneyland Paris in two weeks time and we just needed to get a few bits and pieces to take with us just in case uh, we're not feeling day or whatever. I picked up uh, ibuprofen or ibuprofen I normally call it, ugh, call it. Um, it's just the tablets for pain relief and one packet at Paracetamol. These were three for a pound which is really good. Of course if you're not of age to buy these then don't buy them but these are really good um, and they're good value for money, especially because you're getting three for a pound. I think it's really great. I love the ibuprofen. I think that they are really good, especially for that time of the month. But we're sore heads and stuff like that as well. It's really good. Talking about me and Grant going to Disneyland Paris, we are going to be vlogging Disneyland Paris this time. And hopefully both of us will be in the vlogs. Of course, I've got to try and get my confidence, guys. So... If you have any tips, let me know because I just gonna get a wee bit more embarrassed talking in front of him. If it was anybody else, I don't know why. Me and Grant have been together what eleven years this year, and I don't know why I get myself so wound up speaking in front of the camera in front of him. But um, we, I'm rabbit non. Sorry, we actually got these because or this because it's a twin USB plug, so it has two plugs on it. But we're going to be taking a lot of stuff with us. I've got a new gimbal, I've got my charger pack, I've got quite a lot of stuff that needs to be charged up. So this is the twin one. Um, it's just a plain box. This wasn't a pound, this was, this was only two pounds, but so it was actually really good for the money. Uh, of course, like I said, we actually really needed this because he's already got one, but I'm going to need to charge up quite a lot of stuff um, throughout the night so that the next day it's ready to go for Disneyland Parks and things like that. Let me know if you're excited about the Disneyland vlogs because I am really looking forward to filming them, like I said. I need to get my game on but hopefully it'll be really good and um, they had these in all different colors so if you didn't like the white then you could have got them in a different color another thing that we picked up for the holiday and things like that is this charger cable this is a two-in-one charger cable so it has two different types it has the iPhone charger and the micro 5 pin which I think I'll need both of these and um, this is just kind of goldy color again I think you can get these in different colors um, but this is only a pound which is really good um, and it's a meter long which is nice and that'll be really good for like keeping things charged as well. I normally like to keep a thingy a deodorant, can a deodorant, in my bag for work just because especially with the hot months and stuff like that it's not nice and we have like a hill that we need to walk up to get to work um, and I just normally feel really horrible afterwards so I actually picked up this right guard, it's an invisible one um, and this is the extreme version. Apparently it's 72 hours. I don't know if that's really true because, I mean, I don't know about that. But um, it's just the normal right guard one. I don't know how this smells. Let's see. I, didn't spray. I probably should have sprayed it before buying it. But it smells really fresh. It smells lovely. I got it in the women's section. But I'm imagining that either guys or women can use it. And, of course, it's invisible, which will be good if you're wearing black or if I'm wearing black, um, which is really good. It's just a normal full can worth a deodorant. Dead interesting. The next thing that I picked up in Poundland is something that I kind of always pick up in Poundland, especially when I'm doing these Poundland hauls because Poundland is great for their cleaning stuff. I picked up this Flash Bathroom Febreze scent. Um, one, this is just for in the bathroom, spraying it in the tiles and things like that, getting them all cleaned up. I just really like this. The last time I got the one with bleach in it and it was great, but I wanted something a wee bit more different, so that's why I've got this one. Um, and it's quite handy because it does have this squidgy bit on it. But I, it's definitely nice, and especially because it's the Fruity scent. Normally they smell amazing. You guys know that I always buy like these duck bottles and stuff like that. I've been coming away from duck for a wee while, but I've kind of went back to it purely because I like being able to see that it's where it's got it, like the colouring. And the one that I got last time, it was just pure white. 
whereas this is like a bluey colour and it's in the marine scent um, but it just dissolves lime scale, keeps your bathroom toilet smelling really nice and really clean and no dirty which is great and exactly what I need. I know you guys will have seen this in my other kind of videos and stuff like that. I just picked another one of the Flora. I was going to say Sephora, Flora disinfectants. I got the Country Escape one again because I actually got this one before. It smells amazing, amazing, amazing in the sink. I just think it smells really, really nice and it's quite a big bottle. I think I've said this before, but you just get so much in it. Like it's quite a lot that you actually get in the actual bottle. Um, I don't know if it lasts as long as the actual Sephora itself, but again, it is still quite good for the money itself. And I'm looking forward to putting that in my sinks. The next thing that I picked up in uh, Poundland was this Flash Extra Large Wipes. I got the extra large ones because I think sometimes that they can be really, really good, especially when it comes down to cleaning the bathrooms, cleaning the kitchens, things like that. Um, this is the Blossom and Breeze scent. And it's a Febreze mix as well. Um, the, they're 30 extra large wipes or 60 smaller wipes. I'll probably use kind of both sizes of them but I normally pick these up and I was running it so I just thought I'd get some more of these. Okay guys so I think you're going to find the next product a wee bit more interesting but not interesting in a good way like interesting in a weird way. It may be interesting for some of you guys because yeah let's just get into it. So the next thing that I actually picked up was this VI Poo and it's the Hawaiian Hero scent. Basically what this is supposed to be good for is for if someone goes for a poo and I <laughs> I'm, I can't believe I'm even talking about this. Like, obviously, see, at the end of the day, everybody has to go to the toilet, right? And it's sometimes embarrassing when you have to go to the toilet and then you know that other people are going to go in after you. So I thought that this would be nice for my bathroom just to make sure it smells really nice and also just to make sure it smells nice in general because sometimes some people are embarrassed by going for a poo or going to the toilet and things like that and they just don't want it to smell. This, I've heard this is supposed to be really, really good. And this is only a pound, which is great. Um, of course, like I said... I mean, it's not the greatest thing to be talking about in your channel, but I think it's good because I actually got it for a pound, which is brilliant. Um, I think that's supposed to be really, really good stuff. And this is the Airwick one. And it's in the scent Hawaiian Hero, so it'll keep your bathroom smelling like you're on holiday or something like that. Um, but it just says here, keeps nasty smells in your bowl. Um, it's a pre poos toilet spray, so you spray it in the toilet before you go to the toilet. And then um, hopefully it doesn't stink out the room. And then it lasts up to 300 sprays for up to 100 uses. So that is quite good. Um, of course, like I said, it's not the most interesting thing, but I think it would be useful for some people who do get embarrassed by stuff like that. Um, I know that some people keep it in their bags and things like that if they're going elsewhere or going to work or somewhere like that and they're not really that keen in like, having a, a toilet without having a scent. So... I know that's not the most exciting and probably the most weirdest thing that I've spoken about in my channel but like I said everybody does obviously go to the toilet and this will be useful for you as people who are a little bit more embarrassed by doing that. The last thing I picked up in Poundland was these Just Right Lashes. You guys know I love the Just Right and the Fern Lashes for Poundland. I just think that they are great for the money and these are just so nice. I absolutely love them. Um, these ones are the Wild and Free ones. I think I've had these before. Um, but they are really full and really nice. Um, I just love these. I think that they're really good value for money. You get the eyelash glue in it as well, which is great. And of course, um, they're really nice on. Um, I'm not wearing any lashes just now because I just couldn't be bothered and it's too hot inside and I can't be bothered with that. But the lashes are really nice and I usually use them for like events and stuff like that, which is nice. And of course for a pound, I think it's great because sometimes you can go to like super drug and stuff like that and lashes can be all the way up to like eight pounds nine pounds and stuff like that whereas if you get these these last a couple of wears as well which is great and the light is coming back i don't know guys but i think that that might be the reason um that i'm getting a bit washed out but um yeah i think that these are really good and brilliant for the money and that's it unfortunately that is it i've done every single item that i picked up in poundland i actually managed to get some really good buys in poundland this month i think that it's great value for money i love going to poundland and i love getting a good bargain and i managed to find a good few pieces in there and i'm looking forward to trying out some new bits and pieces that i got as well if you guys enjoyed this video comment down below and let me know what the most interesting thing in the poundland haul was or what you're wanting to buy also subscribe if you're not already subscribed and the light's getting really bright again. 
in there. Subscribe if you're not already subscribed. And until next time, have a magical day and I'll see you real soon. Bye!